Address Resolution Protocol is a protocol that translates IP addresses to MAC addresses, enabling LAN endpoints to communicate. It is necessary due to the different lengths of IP and MAC addresses, which are 32 bits for IPv4 and 128 bits for IPv6. ARP translation is only required when new devices join the network, as the host stores the translated addresses in its ARP cache. Border Gateway Protocol is a routing protocol that manages packets flow through routers in autonomous systems, AS, and connects them to different networks. It can connect endpoints on a LAN to one another and between different LANs over the internet. External BGP directs network traffic from different ASEs to the internet, while internal BGP directs the traffic between endpoints within a single AS. Domain Name System is a database that contains a website's domain name and corresponding IP address. It translates domain names into IP address, and servers can cache DNS data for website access. DNS also includes the DNS protocol, which details specifications for translation and communication. It is crucial for providing quick information and enabling access to remote hosts and resources across the internet. Dynamic Host Configuration Protocol assigns IP addresses to network endpoints for communication with other network endpoints. It automatically assigns a new IP address to a device when it joins a network with a DHCP server for the first time and continues to do so as the device moves. The DHCP handshake process involves establishing a connection, receiving available IP addresses, requesting an IP address, and confirming the address. File Transfer Protocol is a client-server protocol that enables file requests and server supply. It operates over TCP IP and requires a command channel and data channel for communication. Clients request files through the command channel and receive access to download, edit, and copy them through the data channel. Although less popular than HTTP, FTP remains a common network protocol for private file sharing, particularly in banking. Hypertext Transfer Protocol is a file sharing protocol that runs over TCP IP and is primarily used by web browsers to access website domains. It connects to the domain server and requests the site's HTML code. HTTPS or HTTP over secure sockets layer encrypts user requests and web pages, providing more security and preventing cybersecurity threats like man in the middle attacks. Internet Protocol is protocol responsible for functions like a postal service, sending and receiving data in packets with two IP addresses. These packets travel through gateways, like a post office, to reach their destination. IP is often paired with TCP to form TCP IP, the overall internet protocol suite. Together, IP sends packets to their destination, while TCP arranges them in the correct order. Open Shortest Path First is a protocol that works with IP to send packets to their destinations, aiming to send them on the quickest route possible. It opens the shortest path first and updates routing tables, alerting routers of changes. OSPF is similar to Routing Information Protocol, RRIP, and has replaced RIP in many networks. It is a streamlined and scalable alternative to RIP, sending updates only when necessary and to the specific part of the table where the change occurred. Simple Mail Transfer Protocol, a widely used email protocol, is part of the TCP IP suite and controls the sending and receiving of email messages between email clients and servers. It doesn't control the recipients of messages, but can work with Post Office Protocol 3 or Internet Message Access Protocol to ensure proper communication. User Datagram Protocol is a low-latency data transmission method that works with IP to transmit time-sensitive data, making it ideal for VOIP and other audio and video applications. It doesn't wait for all packets to arrive or organize them, unlike TCP, which does. UDP works faster, but is less reliable than TCP.